Hi everyone, this is Kim from the Palo Alto Networks community team bringing you a new Palo Alto Networks video tutorial. In today's tutorial I will go over a nifty trick that actually came up in one of our discussions on our discussion board. So this user wanted to know how clearing commits worked and how exactly that worked prior to PanOS 7.1 because 7.1 introduced commit queues where it's very easy to clear or delete uh, future commits uh, but how does that work exactly or can you even do that in a PanOS version prior to uh, 7.1 um, so I'll, I'll go over both examples to clarify things so let's go ahead and uh, check out our firewalls so first let me show you a system that has commit queues. As you can see, this is a PA500 running a PanOS version 8.0. So let's go ahead and schedule a couple of commits and see how that works. Just gonna do a few simple changes. Gonna change three different rules. And for each change, I'm gonna uh, do a separate commit so I'll have a, a queue of commits that I can uh, basically clear. So, first rule. Right, so I changed three different rules and for each changed I executed the commit. We can easily see that by going to the task link here below. And in the task manager we'll, we will see our three commits. The first one is still ongoing and we have two queued ones. So I can just go ahead and clear the two queued ones by clicking the clear commit queue button. Are you sure? Yes. We'll get a message that the two pending jobs are flushed from the queue. Click OK. And you will notice that they are cancelled. Now my ongoing commit is still running. And if I decide I want to cancel that one, I can still do that depending on how far the job is. So it's still at 0%, it's still in a pending status, so I can still, I can now uh, basically stop that job without an issue. Let's go ahead and do that. There we go, and now we even cancelled the running commit. So this is how it works in PanOS 7.1 and later versions. So every uh, subsequent commit will be added to the queue and you can just clear the queue and you can also uh, clear a running commit depending on how far along is it. Now this is something that's not recommended. Okay so we can go ahead, go ahead and close this and just well revert back to our running config to undo any of the changes we did. Everything's loaded back as it was. So moving forward, let's see how this compares to uh, PanOS version prior to PanOS 7.1. So as you can see here, I'm logged into a firewall running PanOS version 7.0.14. So I'm first going to show you that there is no such thing as a commit queue. You can only do one commit at a time and subsequent commits will fail. So I'll show you that. So similar to the previous example, I'm just going to change two rules and try to commit them. There. Notice that my second commit failed and it's uh, giving me a message that another commit is in progress and I need to wait uh, and basically try again later. 
So there is no commit queues in this PanOS version. So go ahead and close this. While commit queues isn't a feature in this uh, PanOS version, it is still possible to interrupt or cancel a, a running commit. And it acts basically in the same way that uh, I showed you earlier. Uh, let me show you. So I can just go ahead and commit now because my first commit uh, is finished. I'm going to try and uh, well, force my second commit now, which should be no problem. There we go. And in my taskbar, I can verify that my commit is ongoing and I can cancel it using that stop uh, function right there. Notice how my commit is cancelled and my status is failed. So my commit didn't go through. Close this. I'm still seeing my change right here. So I'm just going to revert to my running configuration to undo that latest change. Let's go back to confirm. There you go, my change is reverted back. So again, I would like to emphasize that it's not recommended to cancel or flush a running commit, but it can be handy once in a while. All right, that's it. This concludes this video on clearing commit queues, which is basically possible from uh, PanOS version 7.1 on and clearing running commits, which was an option even uh, before 7.1 PanOS versions. Thanks for watching. <laughs>